Hey guys, so today we are going to be doing a review for a juice. So as y'all know, I love me some delicious juices. Um, I think that there, there's certain times when I do fall off the wagon and drink like soda, but then I always go back on and try to not drink soda. Um, I look really crazy. I went on a walk and then um, I decided to go get myself a drink, you know, and I didn't really want to cross the five point crossway because it's pretty dangerous here. People drive crazy, but I found this and it's, it's okay. I mean, it could be better, but, um, it's low on sugars and it's juice, you know, and then, um, it just says shake well. It's called the toucan coconut juice with pulp. Jugo de coco con pulpa. <laughs> So, um, and it also, one thing that I did notice about it was that products are from Thailand, but it's made in New Jersey. So we're going to see it's an 80% juice and, um, it's really cool. The can's really fun. See how it has a little toucan, but then this part is like ribbed, I guess. So when it sweats, like you don't, um, I'm going to try to open this with one hand guys. Let's see how that goes. Um, opened it yes so um it does have like this whole rib thing so i guess when it sweats it doesn't fall out of your hand which is uh, semi-effective like i guess like if it wasn't ribbed maybe it wouldn't fall out of my hand as much i mean maybe it would fall if it was it wasn't ribbed it'd fall out of my hand more <laughs> my brain guys my brain okay so here goes i always do the sniff test i don't know why Okay, so it definitely has the authenticity of, like, regular coconut juice. Um, when I was small, my dad used to like just coconut juice, just coconuts. Um, and my mom did too, obviously, but they would open holes on the top of the coconut stick, straws in there, and then just drink the coconut water from there. And it would be amazing. And this is what it's reminding me of. Okay, so I just got a little bit of pulp. I don't know how I feel about the pulp. Honestly, like the coconut um, water is probably enough for me um, to like bring back the nostalgia. But um, the water with the pulp, I can do without. Okay. So that third drink, I sort of squeezed the pulp between my tongue and the roof of my mouth. And it had sort of like a... I don't know if the word is processed. Like it had sort of like a processed flavor. And I don't know if I like that. I I don't know. I probably would give it uh like a wait. Just because I like the coconut juice. Okay. So I would give the actual juice like a seven out of ten. And, like, the actual pulp, like, a two out of ten. And it's only because the pulp is super soft, like, mushy. I've had other coconut juices that have pieces of coconut in them, and they're not as mushy. Um, I don't know if it's because the other ones are not as fresh, and these are, or the other way around, the pulp. Um, and if you know me, you know I like juices with pulp in it. Like, I'll have the orange juice with the pulp. I have, I'll have, um... I just like pulpy juices, <laughs> you know, like if it has a pulp, it's amazing. It has pulp. You have something to like, I don't know. It's weird. I am a weird person. Anyways, that's pretty much it for this one. Um, overall, I would recommend it probably like a six out of 10, um, uh, maybe six and a half, seven out of 10. Um, it is a really delicious juice. Would I buy it again? Maybe like if I really wanted like a coconutty juice, um, but I think that I would try to find it without the pulp. Or I would definitely try to, um, I don't know, like maybe strain the pulp or just avoid drinking the pulp. I don't know how I would do that. But, um, yeah, definitely toucan coconut juice is delicious. Um, I would definitely get it a 7 out of 10. And that's really high for me unless it's like delicious. Like it's, oh my God. I think that what makes it worse is a pulp. But I would definitely, um, I would definitely just, like, 
I can do without the pole. Yeah. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you watched to this point, thank you so much. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And lets me know what you like to watch. Also, please leave a uh, comment down below and tell me where you're from because I know I got a lot of new viewers and a lot of friends that didn't know that I had a YouTube channel that are now viewers. Thank you so much for joining. Our family is almost to 100 viewers, guys. I did not expect this, but I'm very excited. It's one of my goals to get our family growing. So make sure you share and comment below and let me know where you're from. Thank you so much. See you next time. Bye.